Welcome to this video on how to create your own picture tubes in Corel PaintShop Pro. PaintShop Pro offers a variety of ways to create stunning images and enhance your photos. The picture tube allows you to stamp a graphic onto your image with a single click, or even spray a number of graphics to create a streamer effect. For example, you can place butterflies and beetles over a picnic setting, or frame a picture with a stream of flowers. Corel Paint Shop Pro offers a collection of picture tubes, but also allows you to create your own. In this tutorial, you will learn how to create a custom picture tube that will allow you to enhance your photos, so let's get started. In this example, I'll be using spring flowers as a theme. Choose a group of photos in which the object you want to turn into a picture tube stands out from its background. This way, it'll be easy to separate or remove the object. You can use the Background Eraser tool from the Tools toolbar to remove the background. You can adjust the size of the Background Eraser tool in the Tool Options palette for smaller areas such as the spaces in between the petals of the flowers. Next, click and move the Background Eraser tool on the background of the image until it's completely removed. For more information on the Background Eraser tool, check out our tutorial on Background Removal in PaintShop Pro. Zoom in to ensure that the background including the smaller areas in the photo was completely removed. You can repeat these steps for the remainder of the images. Once you've removed the background on all of the images that you'll be using for your picture tube, it's now time to combine them. Start by creating a new PaintShop Pro image by clicking File and then New. Next, set the following options. For the image dimensions, set the width and height of the canvas or image. In this example, I'll set the width to 600 pixels and the height to 400 pixels. And enable the transparent checkbox. Open the images that you'll be using for the picture tube. Select an image using the pick tool from the tools toolbar. While the image is selected, press Ctrl and the letter C on your keyboard to copy. Then, click on the new image and use the key combination Control and the letter V to paste. You can resize the image by clicking and dragging the small box or the handles around the image. Repeat these steps until you've copied all of your images into the new document. Next, position the images across the canvas and make sure that the images have equal spaces between them. In the Layers palette, right-click a layer and select Merge and then Visible to create just one raster layer. To save your project, click on File, Export, and then Picture Tube. In the Export Picture Tube dialog box, I'll use the following options. For the cell arrangement, enter the number of cells across and down. Set the value of these fields to match the arrangement of the images. So in this example, the cells across field will be set to 3, and the cells down will be set to 2. The total cells field will then match the number of images placed on the picture tube file. Next, for the placement options, just select the default options for this picture tube as you can change these options when applying the picture tube later. Last of all, enter in the file name for the picture tube and click OK. To use the picture tube you've just created, open an image in PaintShop Pro and click on the picture tube tool. From the Tool Options palette, click on the drop-down list and select the picture tube that you've created from the list. To use the picture tube like a rubber stamp, click once on the image and a random graphic will be placed. To create a streamer of continuous graphics, hold down the left mouse button and drag the cursor around the image. This can be a fun way to create a custom picture frame. You can also change the size of the picture tube in the Tool Options palette. Thank you for watching this video on how to create your own picture tubes in Corel PaintShop Pro.